Hello and welcome back, everyone. Aquamdiel here, and uh, and well, second upload for uh, for uh, today. Um, just if um, just if uh, you tuned in, tuned into to my live stream, um, I did actually uh, technically after I recorded uh, of this video, but I'm but I'm pre-recording this that way I can upload this later and shit like that. But but yes, the the new event has now come out, and I am, and well, not quite. I like this event a lot. All right, I especially love what they're now starting to do with facility events now. All right, because well, first things first. All right, um, um, I'm upgrading uh, this right now, obviously. Um, the these points rewards uh these are honestly exactly exactly uh the same nothing to worry about that but well if we go in here i'm going to be scrolling for a little bit most of these are the same uh town stones are, are are in this one rainbow orbs are now starting to be available Th that's a massive up and also uh if i were to move the on over a little bit New stories will be added, and more items in the treasure trade soon. And as we can see here, tier four orbs and sunlight orbs. I'm liking this a lot. All right, and and well, and, and well, and well, Joseph, you also watched my Galathor overview and banner overview. Just if you stay tuned toward uh, the very end. You will know that I have said that potentially there could be a part two. Now, though, you're probably thinking why I think that. It's not because of Nightmare. It's because of this. This right here, right? Because... Because, uh, oh boy. Not only is this 20k might... But, but well, just if you were paying attention to, to, to the story, there was another character said, and mentioned, and showed, <laughs> and uh, and I have a feeling that they might become a a playable unit. So yeah, definitely keep an eye out uh, for that. Save your currency uh, accordingly. All right. But either way, uh, that will come on uh, the third, as well as as well as a more story. So I'm definitely uh, looking forward uh, to that. Oh yeah, though. Oh yeah, though. That's something else. This will technically come after the gala. So yeah, that's even more confirmation in my eyes. This is coming after the gala. Shoot, I shoot. I think I might be right on that prediction, though. I might be right on that. The. But yeah, other than that, um, this is typically uh, the same. Uh, Nightmare comes out a little bit later. Um, um, you uh, uh, you still do uh, uh, obviously have have your stages and and also the master stages in which I'll, I will be grinding this. I well, I did I did grind this on stream. I should say, damn it, I'm I'm in the past. I'm recording in the past to upload this in the future. Dang it. Ugh, time traveling, am I right? But out of the way, yeah, um, that is a like that was a lot of information. But yeah, now but yeah, now I'm I'm just gonna go over uh the prints. But overall, this is a very nice event. So first of all, we have uh, the free print being Winds in the Night. I did I did not I did not uh, max this out yet when I'm recording this. It's only striking haste by the Holy Or and and uh, Sanctity, and also it being an endeavor, sure. And besides, I besides I get enough copies anyway to mob one, so sure, it's a free print anyway. And now we have a day in her life. Actually, I'm going to go to the win print section. That way I can pull up the fully unbound version. So right here, yeah. day in her life. By the way, Julieta, holy shit. Nice. <laughs> so, so it's a energy double buff and force strike. That's honestly pretty nice because because of a Galathor coming. 
Um, you obviously would want ways to get energy levels as fast as possible for Galathor. So yes, this is very good. And also this actually, dare I say parallel with Albert? Dare I say that? Or just maybe even Guden because Guden can boost his own defense. I might say Guden to be honest. Guden might be good with this. It, because, because you know the standard uh, sword attack, tap, tap, force strike. Yeah. Yeah, there's that. So now we also have Treasury of Knowledge. Cool. And it's Sleeping Punisher and Blind Res. It's, but because Blind Res is 50%, um, some units really can uh, utilize this, uh, actually. That, that does not have a mass 70 at least. So that's pretty good. But Sleeping Punisher, nothing gets put to sleep anymore, really. Like, and the way, sleep is so short, it's almost not worth. It's really just not worth. So honestly, this is more of a collection thing, but but just if you look for a meta use, don't use this for meta reasons. Honestly, do not. Ugh. But yeah, um, and I think that's about it for when it comes to uh, when it comes to uh this event. Um, and once again, I did I did cover the banner in the. Uh, in the previous video I've uploaded, so definitely be sure to check that out, just if uh, just if uh, you are uh, curious about what's coming. And also, while you're browsing through my channel, feel free to subscribe as well to stay up to date on more content. Feel free to join the Discord server down below as well. And uh, I would say that's about it uh, for this video, and I will see you all in the next one. See ya.